of cheating. Um, Again, did you cheat? With, what was it, the Claudia Jordan thing? Yes, Claudia Jordan. No, the Claudia Jordan and her friend, that was, uh, that, I don't know where that came from, but that's false. She's very attractive. Cla but Claudia's, I mean, she's been so good to me and Kenya, our whole relationship. Uh -huh. she's, when we had a movie premiere and Kenya couldn't get her hair done, I called Claudia and said, you got a hairdresser, and then Claudia hooked Kenya up with her hairdresser, so I don't know where that came from at all. So, do you have a girlfriend now, or have you moved on with your life? Do, do you know girls here in New York? Happy 82, how long have you and Gary been dating? Stop being stupid. Never dated Gary. He's never dated any of my friends. Y'all know Tyler, knock it off. Um, yeah, Kenya responded to Gary's interview. It's so dumb. She keeps wanting to um, include me in their divorce, which has nothing to do with me. Um, she wants to uh, accuse Gary of being a deadbeat. His kids are 18 and up. And um, I, I've always known him to be a really good dad, taking his kids. I, I know one of his sons, he, was in, he took his son and his friend to a different city every year. And then, you know, all this other bullshit about, it would have been nice if my son, my kids had been around Snoop. Those kids have grown up around celebrities. They swam in Shaq's pool. They've hung out with Snoop. They, you know, and listen, it'll all come out later on. So um, all I'm concerned about is why the fuck you keep bringing my name into your shit. It has nothing to do with me. You are reaching, and the more you post, the more you look crazy. And at first, people were sympathetic to you, and of course, I still am, actually, but don't create unnecessary casualties. That's all I got to say. And Alonso, why do you hate on Portia? I don't hate on Portia, but I can absolutely speak on what I see like you can. Y'all can speak on me, I can speak on things I see. It's not hate. <clears throat> Y'all know, you know the difference. I really gives, I don't care. She loves that Gary White brought her up now. She got something to talk about. I actually don't like it, me being brought up because I thought we were all. Hi, guys. So I guess this whole story about Gary Owens and his wife, um, Kenya, their divorce is still going, I guess. I don't. I thought it would, you know, it was finalized by now. But um, she, I guess, called him a deadbeat dad or something. And so while he was at this interview with Wendy Williams on Wendy Williams' show last week, um, he sort of responded to some of the things that are kind of out there um, as far as uh, Claudia and Jordan hooking him up, trying to hook him up with one of her friends or something. Um, and so Kenya responded, but she did not go live. She kind of typed everything out. And I'm not getting ready to read all of that, but I will say that she, what she was saying in the statements, um, because she kind of responded to a lot of the things that he was saying on the show. Um, and she said that she's not just talking about monetary support. She's talking about him not reaching out to his children since they separated um, and spending time with them, regardless of uh, monetary support. You know, he still should 
maintain a relationship with them as her father. Um, so that's what she was saying, and that's why she's calling him a deadbeat. Um, she was also saying instead of worrying about her and talking about her, he should have been picking up on the fact that Wendy was trying to hit on him. Um, I, you know, I don't see the Wendy and Gary relationship, but, you know, we'll see. Um, and then she also was clearing up the whole thing about Claudia, because I think Wendy brought up Claudia. And um, Claudia had said in one of her previous lives that she was uh, on a lunch date, I guess, or not a date, or just, you know, not date date, but she was out for lunch with Gary and another one of her friends. And so that is a true statement. There wasn't another woman there at whenever she was having lunch with him. Now, whether she was trying to hook the lady up with Gary or Gary was trying to hook himself up, I don't know. Um, you know, and obviously, if that is, even if that is true, Claudia is not going to say that uh, because it, it will look as if she was trying to match make him and one of her friends. So we don't know what was said, what was going on at this lunch. But she did admit to the fact that there there was another friend of hers there having lunch with it, with him. And so, um, and then she was just saying that Claudia gave her a referral to a hair stylist or something, but, um, you know, they were not friends or building a friendship. So he, she was saying that that's not a true statement that, um, she, she did not have a, a friendship, um, with Claudia like that. Um, so I don't know. What do you guys think about all of this? Do you think that um, do you think that anything will, will come of this? Really, you know, Wendy trying to hook up with him. Um, I don't really see it, but you know, I guess she Wendy trying to have her a hot boy summer or a hot white boy. What is it called? <laughs> whatever it's called, uh, whatever it, you know, chicks is out there talking about, but. Um, because she keeps, uh, for whatever reason, every time she's talking about dating is with a white guy. So I guess she's, you know, taking a break from black men after Calvin. I don't know uh, what to make of it. Let me know what you guys think about all of this in the comments. Um, Claudia went live and she she was asked about, I'm not going to be fair and say she was asked about the situation. Um, she didn't go live just to talk about uh, Gary and his wife, Kenya. But she did bring it up, um, you know, and she said that she just wished they would leave her out of it. Um, you're kind of in it because the wife is maintaining that you were trying to hook her husband up while they were still together. So you are you are in it. You kind of just have to deal with that until it's over. Um, but let me know what you guys think about all of this in the comments. And I think he was there trying to promote a movie, Meet the Blacks. Um, I'm not sure if Cat is in that movie or not, but I'm going to come back to Cat Williams. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.